To clean the sandwich bar, you'll need a solution of hot soapy water and a soft cloth, as well as the satin shine and paper towels. And then you want to grab a bus tub from the dish room and first remove anything um, that is in here so that it's easier to clean. And then you can just set this inside the walk-in so that everything stays cool. Then you'll just want to remove anything that can be ran through the dish machine, including the little metal bars that hold up the containers. And then just take your cloth and wipe along sides to get any of the spills or drips, making sure to pay attention underneath this lid and the outside of the unit as well. If you need to remove the cutting board and clean underneath it, it catches a lot of crumbs and spills. And then you can also take the cutting board back to the dish machine and make sure it's clean on both sides. If there's any discoloration from anything that's been cut on there, you can always use a little tiny bit of bleach if you need to, to make sure that stays nice and clean. Then on the inside, you'll just want to clean underneath the racks on the top and the bottom. They can be removed if necessary. And then wipe the insides of the doors, paying close attention to where um, these little rubber gaskets catch um, lots of crumbs. Then you can ask your instructor to come and check you out of the um, equipment. Make sure you've cleaned it good enough before you put the items back in. When it's time to put the food items back in, just make sure that everything is in date. If it's not, you can discard the item and then just wipe down the containers. And if there's anything that needs to be combined together, you can do that before replacing the items back in the unit.